it up for Susan and Jeff. Wow. Wow. Absolutely phenomenal. First of all, I'll let you catch your breath, but you know what? I'm noticing she's not out of breath. You're like a dancing machine. I got to be honest with you. That was absolutely amazing. If I didn't know Jeff, I would say that you might have been the professional dancer out there. You look so great. So why don't you talk about how much time you put into it, and how great it was to participate in this contest. Um, well, I love the cause, for one thing. And, uh, well, we, I was away an awful lot last month, actually, so I, I just got home and hit the ground running for this. But uh, it was a lot of fun, and it was great. And well, you. you hit the ground running like one of those cars I pull over on the highway, because that thing was motoring like a Ferrari down the freeway. So you did an amazing job. How about your partner? What do you have to say about her? How about the fact that you I mean, I think that her son might have got those moves like inherited, right? What do you think? Give us, a t give us some comment about your partner. Well, Susan and I have been friends for well over 10 years. And we've actually danced socially quite a bit. So this was just really a natural extension of the whole thing. We had a blast. Susan's a great partner and a great friend. Well, I think that we could all see that. You guys look very connected out there. It was amazing. Why don't we talk to the judges and see if they thought the same thing that we think in the audience. Susan, your legs are impeccable. They are phenomenal. I, I, can't, like, I can just go on and on and on about your legs because they're just perfect. But besides that, yeah, yeah pretty Joe, much. Joe has my legs. <laughs> Um, this is a very hard dance to learn, and you made it look very easy. You look like you've been doing it for years. So your action and everything that you've just performed look like you've had years of experience. So good job. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, I don't think um, too many people realize how hard samba is. It is probably the hardest uh, dance to execute technically. I mean, John, of course, you know. You know, yeah, but... Um, but you executed it uh, exactly how it's supposed to be done, very musical, beautiful, but 
We started today with an eyebrow. Remember how I told you dancers practice that eyebrow? And you added the second thing that all dancers practice is the chin. The, <laughs> the chin look. Yeah. Yeah, great. Hey, hey, I could go on and on and on about the legs as well, but, but I wasn't looking, right, honey? I didn't see a thing, I promise. Hey, look, the song took me right back to high school, I'll be honest with you. I was at the senior prom. I swear to God, I was. I was right there. The hips were moving. The bling was flying all over the place. You guys had a lot of lateral movement, which in ballroom dancing, that's where it's at. I'll be honest, a lot of lateral movement. So very nice job. You look good. You looked the part. You were moving all over the place. Nice work. Well, let's see if we get some horizontal movement in those scores, and let's see what we have from our judges, the scores. A nine, a 10, and a nine! Amazing, let's give a big round of applause.